How's it going guys? Welcome back to Quest for Pixels Gaming. I'm Sheldon and today we are playing The Long Dark. I just survived, started survival mode. Um, I was up in that cave there, but I had to fix some audio settings. So we're starting down here by the Hunter's Blind. So the people spoke on Twitter. They wanted survival mode, so we're playing survival mode. Um, we started in Mystery Lake because I still suck at this game, and Mystery Lake is a fairly good place to st- Oh my god, look at this! The hunting knife, and the crowbar. Uh, we'll take the revolver ammunition, take the rifle cartridge, take an arrow, search this first aid kit. And as of right now, we're playing on the normal mode. Um, not like the simple mode, but uh, I think it's called Voyager Because like I said, I'm not I'm not that great at this game yet um, There's still a lot of it that I have to figure out and as you can see I've just started and I am already fucking freezing to death. I wonder if oh no, we'll be fine We can make it We're gonna try if I if we're in the same area that I think we are um, we should be able, there should be a cabin over here. Um, we'll see. We'll see if we find this lake. The lake means cabin, but we can always stay in one of the fishing huts or the ice houses on the lake. Um, let's see. We have some run energy. Be nice though if we could find a, a shelter right off the bat. Uh, let's see if we can find some food. Hell yeah, cattail stocks. Now, we can't spend a lot of time collecting this stuff because we're going to freeze to death. I'd really like to not start off with hypothermia. Yeah, we're going to go back. <laughs> Oops. I don't know Mystery Lake all that well yet, but I do know where a couple of the cabins are. I like the cabin that's down. Yeah, I know. I know you're cold. Um, I like the cabin that's down by the lake because you can uh, go outside, go ice fishing, cook some fish up, come back to your cabin. It's a good central point. It's uh, right up off of the, uh, the railroad tracks. And the railroad tracks have got some good things that you can find along them too. So I'm going to try and collect as many of these cattail stocks as I can while we're walking um, because... I don't think we're gonna get the chance to go food hunting today. Okay, that's it. No more. I gotta run. Um, we're gonna freeze to death. The other thing I like about Mystery Lake is this lake doesn't seem to have any soft spots, so you can't fall through. Oh, uh, we gotta go back. Wait. Wait. So over there is where. Okay, so yeah. Um. We gotta go this way regardless, I think. Maybe there should be some charcoal. I don't know. I'm not gonna use the map during this first episode. You guys choose, okay? I need you to leave a comment and tell me. Do we use the map? Or do we not? Ooh, matches. Oh, well, I guess we surveyed an area. That was an accident. Should we use the map or not? Leave your comments and uh, we will go with whatever you guys decide next episode. So let me know. Man, this all feels so different. No, it's this way. Yep, up there. Okay, so the cabin's right up there, so we're doing good. We're cold, we're dying a little bit, but we're going to warm up soon. Ooh, sewing kit, hell yeah. Some reclaimed wood. Ooh, hell yeah. Cedar firewood. Let's take the charcoal and put it away. I like that in survival mode, you level up your skills and stuff. See, I, I didn't I didn't know that that's how it worked because that doesn't that's not like the way it works in uh in the story mode. But I can already tell with what I've seen or survival mode that I'm gonna have a hell of a lot more fun with survival than story. The story's really good though. I'm still finishing the story because it's not often 
that a video game story um, catches my interest. I'm more of a gameplay guy, and it's not often that a story, you know, hits me emotionally. And the end of chapter one was so sad, and chapter two has been pretty badass, and I like that. It's gonna get dark and colder, but we got just enough time. We could break one more of these. No, that's just twigs. Well, we got one plank, so it should warm us up enough. We get in here, we'll check out that scarf we found. So I know, oh, it's really dark in here. Man, I really don't want to use a match, but we're going to have to. Fuck! Oh, oh, never mind. Actually, we're going to use the paper just because paper seems like a better option. And we'll use the firewood. Come on, baby. No whammies, no whammies. Big money, big money. Fuck! This is it. Third time's a charm. So the tinder plugs must work better for starting fires. I'm just going to go with that. All right, let's warm our ass up. What are we at, two hours still? Um, we need to boil some water. Once we get all nice and warmed up, we'll take a torch, maybe explore some. All right, so I think we will do our searching in the morning but I want to I'm gonna break this down okay I'm gonna waste a match so we can find our way upstairs man where's the bed uh, there uh, empty empty all right so um, on the docket for today we are gonna need some food actually let's uh we got some cattails here. 86. Let's let's do it one more time. Our coats are important, so um, pants. We're gonna fix them just a bit because we're gonna spend a lot of time outside today. I usually try and wait till like noonish. It sounds pretty good out right now, but uh, grab our can so we can make some water. Put it away. Okay. What time is it? How much time do we waste? A lot. All right. We might end up setting up camp across the lake today. We're going to hit a couple of the ice fishing house or ice houses. Oh, shit. I feel like he's getting really thirsty really quick. Uh, actually, let's drink this. And my idea. Let me search this one. My idea is we will get we will get like one base set up in each area. Um, I know like the first place that I want to go is uh, through the Forlorn Musket to is it Coastal Highway? I think I don't know. Either way, it is. Um, there's a, like a a gas station with a four or I don't know repair shop gas station but it's got a forge in it and a whole bunch of good stuff that we can collect so yeah see see like I said these cabins are fairly empty uh, let's check under the bed and never know what to hide in until we get the bow and arrow or the uh, rifle Oh, and also there's a uh, like a 357 Magnum handgun now, which could prove to be pretty useful. It's a uh... oh hatchet, awesome. Let's go. Uh, let's go get ourselves some more wood. Hell yeah, three chunks of wood and enough daylight to still. Shit! 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 Oh, thank God, guys. Whew, I start shaking. Ooh. Fucking wolves. I don't know. I don't like to starve because if you get, like, the well-fed bonus and you keep your stomach, like, at least before he starts to complain, then you can carry more. 
in story mode, I had it up to 77 pounds, which is freaking awesome. All right, so it's a little bit daylight. Oh, yeah, look at that. We forgot to search this. Empty, of course. Crouch, we'll look under everything, and then we're going to move on. I know that cabin doesn't have a... Let's, we're going to come over here. We have to. We're going to boil some water. Uh, do any of you guys know? Um, do your skills... Your skills must level up. I mean, from what I understand, I guess. No whammy, no whammy, big money, big money. I hate when it gets to that point and goes out. That really pisses you off. Okay. Where are we with the day? It's still noon. We're tired. Our stomach hurts, but we're going to go check this cab and then we'll go back. Maybe we'll find some food. If we can find some more food, we can get a full stomach and then a full night's rest. And we'll have the well-fed bonus so we can carry more. I see something over here though. Is that a rabbit? Oh no, it's not. In the story mode, I never used the purification tablets by now, so I never really had to worry about it. I played, oh, there's fishing tackle. That'd have been nice. I think we are going to search really fast, see if we're missing anything, then we're going to run back over to that hole, try and fish a little bit. Um, let's, uh, let's break that down. I'd like to have some warmth while we, while we fish. Um, the only bad thing about the fog is I'm not very good at finding where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, we'll rest for an hour. Well. Our health is okay. Let's uh break that open. Now let's uh fish for three hours. Come on. I should have read the ice fishing magazine. Hell yeah! Food. Fish are heavy though. Oh, you were hungrier earlier. You liar. Stop trying to make me feel bad. But man, I just can't get over how good of a survival game this is. I really, really... So I saw an update um, from Hinterland or Hitherland or however you say their name, Studios. And they said that they have got the Switch version running at about 20 frames per second. And they said that 30 frames per second is as low as they will allow it. I'm just happy that they're still working on it. Like, they didn't give up hope because last March there was a like an ask me anything kind of thing with them on uh on reddit and they were saying well the switch just doesn't have enough horsepower to run it and it's like bullshit it's a unity game i mean you're just having issues getting it ported because unity is kind of shitty this is the best unity game i've ever played though but in general unity is a really crappy we're gonna use accelerant because hell yeah we're going to cook our fish. I think we're just going to go ahead and eat it. Repair our boots, hopefully. All right. It's, uh, those are at 100%. Repair our long johns. We need to see if we can't... F we should do that. Let's go find some rabbits, baby. Um, we're going to go... We're going to go up this way. What time is it? In the morning. It's kind of cold. We're about, a, we're about you know, one arrow down. Actually, what temperature is it? Feels like 19. Man, you shouldn't be getting cold in 19 degrees. Where I live in Montana. Okay, for example, two years ago, in January... Or it was either January or February. It was negative 38 ambient, not with wind. Negative 38 degrees for like two weeks straight. A couple of the days with wind chill, it got down to like negative 52. And I survived. Just saying. Depending on how much we find, actually, let's let's check. I don't know. You know what? We're going to break that down. 
we got the time we can carry it do some exploring I think up over here is the trappers you know what maybe we should head that way hell yeah look how long we could sprint and if you don't sprint down to the red your uh, sprint actually recovers faster frostbite we're not even halfway cold yet whatever are we actually frostbitten oh just risk I hope the trappers camp or trappers cabin exists because that's a story mode place I'm not sure oh we'll sprain our ankle my luck the trappers cabin is a story building so I don't know if they actually exist outside a story but I know it's this direction so man even in the story mode with the map I had a hard time finding a trappers cabin I get so mixed up back here we're gonna have to go this way I'm pretty sure you think this flare would warm us up a little bit these bastards are hot all right so it should be right over here oh that's it okay cool <clears throat> so we might make that home for today depending on the situation with it now that'll just be a good stopping point for this episode all right hell yeah guys we got some meat and some cured gut <laughs> hell yeah all right I wasn't expecting that at all that's great da -da -da -da. captain obvious all right, I bet there's some good stuff in here, boys. Well, we got deer, so chill out. Oh, I bet the, I bet the rifle's in here. Let's see, it's right, left, right. It'd be dope if the handgun was in here. Oh, look at that score! Hell yeah! Fucking <clears throat> snow boots. 89 percent let's wear them let's oh wait a minute oh let's harvest these bastards actually okay, let's take it i don't I mean, they provide nothing for warmth but hell yeah coffee just what i was looking for Oh yeah, so I was thinking about this. So your skill level, you find those magazines and books, and then you read them, and that raises your skill level. That's that's right. Let's cook our damn venison. Hell yeah! All right, let's get some food in us. You know what? I'm gonna want a full stomach when we. Oh shit! Cancel. Let's uh. Can we cook this? I'm gonna eat this right now just because I don't want to waste it. And that's going to give us a full freaking stomach. We're going to get the well-fed bonus. We're just going to finish this off too. Okay. How much time do we got on this? Three minutes? I want to cook some coffee. Let's do some more searching. Ooh, flare. Sewing kit. And a magnifying lens. Hell yeah. Candy bow. Oh yeah, I want some... Uh... Damn, I should have brought the pry bar. Oh, there's no cloth. You should be able to tear that up. Yeah, you can. Got a snare. Need scrap metal. There's absolutely zero fabric in here. Oh wait. Nope. And take that jerry can. You know what? We can do this. That should give us the well-rested bonus. We're gonna drink some water. I know this might be a waste, but the well well rested bonus will definitely be good. Let's see. What can we dick around with for a few minutes? Um craft this stuff in the night. Um so I think we're gonna call this the end. Uh thank you guys for watching i really hope you guys enjoy this i think i think you guys do i had a lot of uh, a lot of votes on on the twitter poll so we're going to be playing this we're, we're going to go back and forth between this and my summer car so uh should be good but 
what else is there not much make sure you guys uh like and subscribe that's always good makes the youtubes happy and uh like i said leave leave me a comment let me know if we should continue playing on this mode or if we should go to scavenger um i'm not sure that's up to you guys so but until next time guys thank you and good night